With this type of app that we're using today, it's a push notification. We have the ability to push out notifications, whether it's a hazmat call, whether it's a fire call, whether it's just general information. So we, we've used this app on different businesses. We've used it uh, for the realtors. We've used it for um, through BSU, our utilities department. If they have a water main break, we partner with them and we'll push out that notification to them also. We've used it with uh, different public events also with the city. If we're gonna do something for the city, they may have a road closure in downtown Benita Springs. So, uh, and when we started this, we looked at it for the reason of uh, hurricanes. We provide sandbags and sand at this, at this fire station. So this would, again, instead of getting 30 phone calls, please download our app, all the information will be on that. So in this day and age with apps being so prevalent, I think that that's the reason why. One of the things that we really wanted was to be able to send notifications to our community about hazardous weather or about traffic issues that we wanted them to avoid. And it's really helped our firefighters on scene with multi-vehicle collisions because hopefully the people who are utilizing the app get these push notifications and know to avoid the area. Same with wildfires. Wildfires has been a big issue here in Bonita Springs, so we're able to notify our community when we have a prescribed burn going on, where it's going to be, where they're going to see columns of smoke, and why it's okay to see that, not to worry. Um, and so it gives our community peace of mind, which is really what we're here for.